I am going to talk about vector addition by using component method. Okay, let's say this is a map. So west, east, north, south. So there are five locations on the map. Location one, two, three, four, and five. So let's say I am in location one. So I want to walk from here to here. So let's say I walk like this. So I arrive here. So this is my initial position, final position. So I connect these points by a straight line. This is my displacement vector. Let's call this is A. So I draw parallel from here, west east line. So this is west, this is east. Let's say this is 15 degree. So my displacement vector A, so 56 meter. Let's assume this is 60, 56 meter. So 15 degree south O east. So it doesn't matter how can I walk from here to here, which route I follow, even this way is okay, or I walk this way, doesn't matter, as long as my initial position and final position do not change. So from 2, point 2, point 3 I traveled, again this I draw parallel west east line let's say this is 70 degree so i call this vector b distance 20 meter okay 70 degree north o west from point 3 to 4 okay i connect this straight line again so this is vector c so 35 degree, 37 degree, north o west. So again, this is west is line. So this is 37 degree. So from location 4 to 5, this is just south. So this is vector D. Let's call this is vector D. This distance. 12 meter south. Yeah, the, all those meters. Meters. Okay. So basically, I travel from location 1, 2, and 3, and 4, and 5. So this is A, B, C, D. How can I find some of A, B, C, D? Basically, what is A plus? vector b plus vector c plus vector d this is the question okay so my whole trip i started here then go here go here so end up here so this is my whole trip from here to here so this will be the resultant vector if i call this vector R so A plus B plus C plus D must equal R so it doesn't matter if we do let's say if we change the order B plus D plus C for example plus A again again equal R. Okay, so this map become very messy, so I I am going to make it clearer map. We have get a clear map right now, so it is always convenient to use X Y coordinate system instead of west is north south, so this is positive positive 
negative, negative. Okay, if I bring my x y coordinate here, so this is x, this is y. Like in trigonometry, we go angle from positive x axis go counterclockwise. So this is the vector a. So how can we calculate x component of a magnitude 56 times this angle. This angle 360 minus 15 degree basically cosine 345 degree. So this is equal 54.1. For y component everything same except this becomes sine. So 56 times sine 345 equal negative 14.5. So if I put this in a graph, let's say this is x component, y component, this is a, so a will, ax will be 54.1, negative 14.5. Okay, for vector b, I bring x, y this time here, x, y, Okay, so this is from positive x-axis, basically 180 minus 70, 180 minus 70, so 110 degree. So I go bx equal, so magnitude b is 20, 20 times cosine 110. So I get this one, negative 6.8. So by, I write 20 times sine 110, so I get 18.8. .8. So I write this here for b, negative 6.8, 18.8. Okay, so when I go cx, So I bring x, y here this time, so this is 37, so when I start from positive x axis, basically 180 minus 37, 180 minus 37, 180 minus 37. Okay, so I write magnitude c is 35, cosine, so this is 143, 143 equal negative 28. So CY, I go 35, sine 143 equal 21.1. So if I write, okay, I'll put C here, CX equal negative 28. This is CX, CY 21.1. So for D, for vector DX, DY, as you see, X component 0, Y component negative 12, or we can confirm like this. So we write 12 times. This angle from positive x axis 270. Cosine 270 or 12 times sine 270. We get same number. So when I put D here, this is 0, this is negative 12. So when I add all those numbers, I get R. This is Rx. So when I add all those, I get 19.3. So when I add this, 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 this number, 
target RY 13.4. Okay. So, <coughs> both of them positive. So I go like this. RX 19. So this is 19. This is 13.4. This is a little bit shorter than this one. So I make rectangular. This is R. So basically this is R. This is Rx. This is Ry. Okay. So this is Ry also. Equal to this one. Because rectangular. How can I calculate R? I use Pythagorean theorem R magnitude of R basically. Okay. So Rx square plus R, Ry square. So basically 19.3 square plus 13.4 square. Square root. So I get 23.5 meter. Okay. How can I calculate so I need direction, this angle, theta. Okay, so I need a room here. What do I just erase this? So basically theta equals 10 inverse tangent Ry over Rx. Ry equal 13.5. Or Rx 19.3. So from here we get 35 degree. Okay. What is the final answer? So I can write now R. So R is magnitude is 23.5. Thirty-five degree north of east. So this is the final answer. Okay. Thank, thank you very much for watching my video. Have a nice day. Bye.